Can't wait. I love this stuff. We've got an arc fall on its way. You never know what's going to come out of those things, so take precautions. Looks like they brought some backup. Get ready. in the crystal. It's gonna explode! That looks like the last of them. Total score is 600. Let's go. I can't hit first for shit. <laughs> I just can't. this I think this is a race yeah this is a race At least I got something. I didn't expect to even get that. I'm detecting an incoming arc fall. I have high hopes for this, but let's be careful. Challenge nearby. These tests of skill will allow you to compare your performance with other Arc Hunters. Looks like 
they brought some tobacco. Get ready. So hold your ground. Mutated soldiers incoming. You came along. Thanks. Yeah, I get it. I'm hurt. You know what? That arc fall never finished.
Bye. Fucking piece of shit. Hellion's hideous moss. That's the only way to hurt it. That's the only way to hurt it. Okay, I heard you the first thirty. hideous moss. That's the only way to hurt it. hideous moss. That's the only way to hurt it. Okay, I'm never doing this. Shoot the 
Battalion's hideous moss. That's the only way to hurt it. The symbiote has detached from the body. Kill it before it retreats. Now we're talking. Points for that? Nice. The symbiote has detached from the body. Kill it before it retreats. I need an art key for the chest. Oh, okay, that's what the art keys are for. Well, that's one way to learn. Got a new sniper. Though. I'll take that. That's three times better than the one that I have.
I came in fifth out of however many. Need art keys. Don't remember how to get them. I'm, I'm guessing completing story stuff. Yeehaw. I like that sniper. <laughs> I do. It looks cool. successfully harvested. I'm detecting more hellbugs on their way. That's the sample we need. Nice work. see a challenge here. trouble from the east.
Mutants coming in from the west. bringing trouble from the east. start getting into one of these. There's a mark for death. I think that's cool. What's going on? We haven't gotten kicked yet. Kind of testing server stability. That's the end of those guys. <sighs> How did I get it? Um, oh, you just, you just, it's part of the story, actually. It's like the first thing that you get. You probably already have it. If you're playing the game, I wouldn't I wouldn't doubt that you already have it. Just go into your character sheet right here and go onto your vehicles and go look at what you got. Like, 
I think... I don't know, maybe not. Maybe... Maybe you don't start with it. Maybe you start with this little growler thingy. I'm not sure. I don't think, but I don't... I'm not positive now. Might have been because I played the original game or something. I don't know. I mean, I... I didn't register that, so... I don't know. I was thinking it was something I started with, and now that I look at it, I'm like, you know, I actually... Thanks. The E-Rep needs people like you. Let's get some wheels. I think that's the challenge I was talking about. I'm detecting an incoming arc bomb. I have high hopes for this, but let's be careful. So hold your ground. stable still not, I'm not gonna get kicked every 15 minutes if the game never if it, if it doesn't write that then I guess I won't be playing this again you can't make any progress you can't really do anything I guess there's people who are either getting lucky on the right servers or they don't mind reloading every 10 minutes to play it but not for me Yeah, I don't, it, um, go to, go to the store, and I don't remember where the, where, where exactly it's at, because, like, all the menus have changed a little bit since the original, so, like, what I thought I remembered from the original, a lot of it's, a lot of it's changed, I mean, the game's still basically the same, but, like, the menus are different, they've got different things that, that, uh, you can work with and stuff, but there's, there's, like, a list of free items that you already have, it's a claim, you, you, you gotta claim them. You may already have all of it. Like, I don't know. Uh, I'd have to show you. Try this one more time, I, I guess. But yeah, I, I, I get kicked every 15 minutes. If I want, if I want that, I'll just go play a Bethesda game.
This is what I'm I getting, live I'm getting for. kicked every 15 to 15 20 minutes. Every 15 20 minutes like I'm I'm just sitting here playing expecting it. Felt like it was maybe a little smoother a while ago but then just got kicked again so All right, so I think if you go to the store uh, there it is. Claim items. See it up there at the top? It's right next to the shopping basket. I had a whole list of free shit. There was like some names and a couple outfits and a buggy and I think a car. And I had just some different stuff. So if you don't have anything there, then I, I don't know what to tell you. Because like I didn't do anything special to get that. That was as soon as I downloaded the, the game, it was already there. I've, you know, I've done this quest like nine times and it won't complete. It just won't. And I, Let's find what the I medical do. supplies. Watch out for the mutants along the way, though. Now you this will go a long way for Grant and his men. We got him. Nice work. Now let's get to the roof and signal the medics. in sight advancing the earth republic team has arrived where'd they get those helicopters wait those are mutants help this is not what i signed on for look for cover we need to clear this area of hostiles shit i've been hit That's completed. You're unstoppable. Good work. Area secured. So I don't think this is something you repeat. You're supposed to repeat either. Of course, last time I still had those dudes with the shields running around. Uh, even after we got the last little thing right there, so. Also, I'm, I'm getting in this bad habit of uh, equipping weapons. Instead of just picking them up. Keep doing that. So mid-fight, I'm constantly switching to all these different, this different bullshit. Incoming. Here comes 
comes more of them. Oh, cool. <laughs> Vendor. Okay, now these are the... These are kind of like the vendors that I remember. So now it's something that you basically earn. I see. Okay. You like got to uh, protect one and then you can buy something from them. I remember these things being at the bases. It, it, didn't they? Used to be things like that. And like certain bases sold certain shit. shit like you had the, the Von Bach uh, settlement or whatever. And you could, and you could buy... Uh, Von Bach industry stuff there. So I, I don't know. I mean, I may be remembering it wrong. But. See, these things are like little SMG. But it's not considered an SMG, I don't think. Is it? Yeah, it's a fully automatic pistol. It's considered a pistol. I don't, I'm not a big fan. What the uh, wonder which class specializes in uh, SMGs. I really like the ability to stealth, but okay, so, let's see. so that's an SMG, that's a stealth. Like a rocket launcher. <laughs> this is all smooth, though. I remember this being kind of clunky before. <laughs> I 
Uh, now, when you push over on the right stick, the first time you go into your loadout, you're forced to switch loadouts instead of being able to navigate through your menu. That's a problem. That's definitely a problem. Okay, so I just had that merchant here. There are people here who need to be rescued. Never mind, he's gone. Europe needs people like you. Fight. Republic technician in need of assistance. Thought I was a goner. Thanks, pal. You won't regret this. Get me out of here! Over here! I need some help! Thanks, pal. You won't regret this. I knew someone Get would come. Command wouldn't leave me to rot. Can't play it, man. I give it another day or two, and then they still can't get it. You get, you know, you give, you give a game a week. If, it's, if it can't, if it can't get even one of its fucking ducks in a row in a week, then they shouldn't have launched the game because they are incapable of supporting the servers and maintaining them. I'm not saying that's going to be the case, but it's been three days now. And you're in, the, you're in the first weekend. This is when your players are going to play your game or never play your game again. Just, it just came out, what, Wednesday or something? Kind of no one heard about it. Okay, fine. People hear about it. They want a new game to play for the weekend. Get a little time off and get in here. Can't play more than 10 minutes at a time. It's not going to fly. That is not going to fly. This is, this is their opportunity to make it right and... Well, we'll see if by next weekend it's it's not even uh, remotely functional. Then I'll give up on it. What a shame. It could be fun, but it's hard to start to get into something when you just assume that you're going to get kicked in the next five minutes. And then you do every fucking time. Can't play like that. I, I, I can't. Maybe some people can. I can't. Obviously, some people have made some progress here. But... Uh, All right. PS4. Well, that's great. I'm playing on Xbox One, so you know that um, that's that's just awesome for for that. Uh, hmm. I was really, really kind of hoping it'd be up and running today because this is kind of what I wanted to mess around with today. Start to learn some of the things. Just finally learned what the hell the art keys are used for. Chests at the end of the major art falls. Didn't know that. I, I, I'm trying to now figure out how to earn art keys. I know you don't have to buy them. They won't make you buy them. 
I know you can buy them, but I don't think they'll make you. I believe there's way to, or ways to earn them. You're just going to have to go work for it. But. Next, all right. I'm not saying either. I just I've got it here. I already I already supported the game here. Bought one of their little package things, you know, when I got the game. After I got it, I you know, wanted to see if it was up and running and it was playing a little bit. And I'm like, okay, we'll give it some time to get the server. So I'll support, you know, you support the game. It's a good game. The game itself, it's it's cool in design. It's like Borderlands Online. I'm not knocking it. But if you can't play it, well, then shit, what's, you know, I, I gave them my two cents. I actually gave them more than two cents. So they got my little bit of money. They need to get on the ball and get this shit up and, up and running. Um, having it work on one console and not another, that's just going to, honestly, that's just going to create stupid controversy with people who don't have anything better to do. And I, you know, I just want it to work here. I mean, if I'd have known there was fewer problems on PlayStation, I would have just gotten it there instead. But I didn't know that. Well, I guess I'm going to get out of here. Just thought I'd boot this up this morning and see where it was at. It's no better than it was two days ago. It's doing the exact same thing. Same amount of time and everything. And there's no, there's like no warning. It's playing fine. There's almost no, remember, remember how the original Defiance, how bad the rubber banding was? Enemies would just disappear. Quests you'd be in the middle of them, they'd just vanish. Or you'd complete something and it never completed, but it would stay up there. And until it completed, you couldn't do anything else. I mean, you could go do it, but you couldn't get credit for it. Once, if, if a quest wouldn't complete, you couldn't complete it. Other quests either, you know, that type of shit. I haven't run into really any of that. Nothing major. So, you know, it's, it's, as far as gameplay goes, it's stable. But disconnect issues, getting kicked every 10 minutes, five minutes. I don't care how good the game is. If you can't play it, you can't play it. You know, that's, that's just, oh, well. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, I mean, they, they obviously, they obviously cleaned up a lot of the issues, but I, I'm not the only one experiencing this. Maybe it's just an Xbox thing. Although I believe the PC players are having the same problem with disconnect stuff. I don't think it was, you know, but, uh. So if PS4 is the only servers they got up and working, that doesn't really make sense. Although uh, the game is going to be coded different for PlayStation. It's going to be coded different. X Xbox and PC are going to be almost the same. Because, well, an Xbox is essentially PC. I mean, it's, it's really, really close. It's almost the same thing. Very similar operating system and stuff like that. PlayStation is different. Like when you make a game for PlayStation Xbox, you have to make two different games. You know, I mean, it's the same game essentially. It's the same assets, but from what I understand, it's 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 written completely different to put it on uh, uh, PlayStation as opposed to Xbox. It's yeah, it's like a, almost a separate development for that. Um, so that may be it. Maybe something just works right for the PlayStation and when it comes to PC and Xbox it's just garbage I, I don't know but uh whatever well I guess I'm gonna find something to play today I don't know what I want to play for lack of anything else I kind of wanted to play this I might see if Divinity 2 will pop up on backwards compatible I'm kind of curious if there's an emulator for that I don't know hell I may go take a nap I don't know well, I guess I'm going to get out of here. Like I said, there's no there's no point in trying this. It's I've already been kicked 3 times and I haven't I haven't even been on an hour yet. 55 minute stream and I've been kicked 3 times. That's that's no fun. So, let me head out. Um might catch you guys later today with something. I guess it's going to be something of a surprise cuz I don't really know if I stream at all today. I, I don't know what it'll be. Couldn't tell you. I guess we'll figure it out when we get there. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head out. Hope you find your uh, your stuff in the claim list. Remember, when you get into your character menu, hit your right bumper, or if you're on PlayStation, your what is it, right right one, whatever. You know your little your little bumper button. Uh, hit that and go over to claims. You probably have a bunch of shit in your claim section. Um, don't know if it carried over from you having played the original Defiance or not. 
from what I understand, there was way to there was a way to get some stuff to acknowledge your commitment to the first game. You know, people who had, who'd played the shit out of that, they didn't want to start over from scratch. Although I don't think people were able to like port over their max level characters with ultra rare end game shit. I don't think they were able to do that. Um, I don't know. But I think there was some acknowledgement if you played the original, so that may be part of it too. But if you played the first one, whether you did or not, it seems that just just for uh, just for playing the game, they give you some stuff to start with. I, I don't I don't think I got anything special like weapon wise. I think it was just that little forerunner, I think, and uh, and that car, that big old beefy car, and a couple outfits and some names. I think that's all it was. But hey. It's stuff, and it's free, so. Hey, Josh, what's up, man? You didn't get no claims, huh? Um, I don't know. Unless you, maybe you're playing with a new, a new PSN ID, a new gamer tag. You know, if it's a different account, then... Maybe the, or maybe it's an Xbox thing. I don't know. I mean, you you can get the four runners anyway. You can get them in the game. I, I don't remember exactly where you get them. It, it used to be it was like, it wasn't the Von Bach base. It was one of the other bases. You could get, one of them had four runners, one of them had buggies, and one of them had uh, something else. You remember that? Like the big, uh, uh, what kind of like uh, Hummer, Hummer type type cars that you could seat like four people in or something. You remember? Anyway, uh, different places you could buy different shit, and then you could buy like upgrades for them. I don't remember exactly how the upgrades went, but I mean they're they're there anyway. Like it's who cares? I, now it, it is an advantage in certain races. You know, uh, doing stunts are better in four four runners than they are in cars because you can do like three sixties and. 720s and shit like that. So. Okay, well, I mean, I don't know, man. If, if you ask me, I can't tell you. So if you ask me again, I can tell you what I told you the first time. I, I can't, nothing. I don't know. I, all I can tell you is where I found that shit. I have no idea why it was there. I would Google it, I guess. I, I, don't, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to say. Just got off work, Josh? Gotcha. Well, Josh, this game's amazing, and I'd love to show it to you, but uh, it keeps it keeps crashing, it keeps kicking. Michael here is saying that PlayStation users aren't having this problem, but uh, I already sunk a little money in it here on Xbox, so I'm I'm hoping that they get their shit together. But I'd say I got kicked three times in less than an hour, so it's about every 15, 20 minutes you just get booted. Just I, for I don't know why. Gameplay is solid though. It's actually it actually I think runs a little smoother than the original game. So that's cool. But uh relax. Don't tell me what to do on my stream. I'll freak out if I want to, actually. I will freak out if I want to. Not freaking out if somehow I'm intimidating you or something by just being here and then Maybe you need to grow some thicker skin and not worry about what I'm doing or not doing. You do you. Um, yeah, Josh, I was fixing to fixing to shut it down. I kind of wanted to play this today, actually, but uh, it's just it's not running. Well, I can show it to you. I mean, I since I'm here. You want to check it out? It just won't stay up more than 10 15 minutes at a time.
Black Ops 4 Battle Royale. What are you talking about? Fallout 76? Otherwise known as Fallout 76? What excitement should Black we Ops Battle today? Royale? Oh, it's all right. I mean, I, I wanted to play today, but like, I just, it's play for about 15 minutes. No problems. It's smooth as silk. It's working great. Kick, just black screen back to the dashboard about every 15 minutes, 10, 15 minutes, every time. No exceptions. Kind of hard to play like that. Um, look at the size of this map, dude. This is the game world. Not sure what's down here. I don't remember this area down here. Return to San Francisco. I don't remember what that is. But this is like Earth now, or this is like what's left of California right here, basically, I guess. Here's San Francisco. <laughs> Oh, cool. You have these, uh, what, this is basically what the game is kind of based on, is these arc falls here. This is where a lot of your XP and loot comes from. But you, uh... Ready to roll. You jump in and you start clearing these out, and then, assuming the game doesn't kick you, which it will, we won't be able to clear all these before the game crashes, but... Uh, it's, it's a lot like Borderlands. Got an arc fall on its way. You never know what's going to come out of those things, so take precautions. I'm detecting and I, a lot I don't of drive any right under your feet. We need to get the survivors out of here as fast as we can. See the next arc fall over there? So what you do is you basically rush to the next one. You want to get to each one kind of as fast as you can so you can get as much progress and then eventually they'll have like a major arc fall. And once you eventually learn the whole game world, then it makes it easier to get from one spot to the next. You start learning where all the dead ends are and all that type of shit. This you gotta go up and over, I think. We'll just play till it kicks me again.
I've timed out by playing. Can't, can't play like that. How much better than the first one? It's the same, pretty much the same. I mean, they just cleaned up some of the tech, the gameplay issues. Like before it was just, Scene was an MMO and there was a lot of players in the game world and lots of shit going on. Some things like a quest wouldn't complete. And so if it never completed, you couldn't start a new one. And even if you did, you couldn't complete that because the first one was still hanging. You would even see it like a notification, like you did the last objective for whatever the little quest was but it wouldn't, it wouldn't click. So it would just hang there. And eventually it probably bogged down your character and get you kicked from the server and stuff like that. Used to have issues with a lot of rubber banding enemies. You'd be shooting them over there, they'd disappear and reappear over here. And then maybe the quest you were doing would just vanish. Like all the enemies and everything that was placed. Cause almost everything's random. Like there's just shit that just spawns, happens and you go deal with it whether you're in a group or you're doing it by yourself and then you move on to the next thing. Like you can run around all day just jump, jumping in with groups fighting arc falls, but play by yourself. And then go do race challenges and go do gun challenges and skill challenges and time challenges if you feel like it. If you don't, don't. And then there's actual dungeons, set dungeons where enemies are placed and then you eventually have a boss. And you can go in there with a group and go in there, you know, like with a little team and go deal with that. Uh, you can, and if you don't have a group, you can go queue up and sign in with another group already doing it. That type of thing. As long, you know, and they kind of put you in there. It, if I remember right, it basically made players available that were all roughly within the same level. So you could all go do it together. But, uh... That was, uh, I mean, they've cleaned a lot of that up. Like, I haven't run into any real glitches. I just can't play for more than 10 minutes at a time. That's the only problem. Like, what? <sighs> Doesn't matter how good the game is if you're sitting here at the dashboard wondering why you can't complete a single fucking quest because you're getting kicked there. It's just frustrating. I would think that if this was my game, I would sink all my shit into getting that shit fixed yesterday. Being Friday, Okay, I would want this shit up for the weekend. This is the first weekend after release. When is everybody gonna be playing my game? Well, they can't because they're all getting kicked unless apparently you're on PlayStation, then it's okay. But if you're on PC or Xbox, you're getting your shit kicked in every, every eight, 10, 12 minutes. That's not gonna work, man. That's, I don't know. I mean, if I was them, these servers would be down right now. D down, off and that shit would be getting worked out. They would be maintaining these servers right now instead of trying to like keep them going and stuff. Bad gameplay is worse than no gameplay in this case. Show me that you're trying to get this shit right so that when I actually do get on, I can actually play for a while. I can respect that, but getting on while you're trying to string it out when it's got more problems than it does have, than it has not problems, that's not gonna work. What's up? Other than that, I don't, I don't think like, when you get in, the menus are a little different, but the gameplay's about the same, it's smoother, and, and the game doesn't really look any better. Like, they didn't waste all their assets on visuals. It looks like they spent most of their assets on making the game run, you know what I mean? Which is good, but uh, it's the connectivity thing right now, so. Well, I was gonna get out of here before. It's, uh, yeah, as you can see, it's... Other than that, it's all right. So, uh... Anyway. It is what it is. All right, well, I'm gonna go. I gotta find something else to play today because this is obviously out of the, uh... This is off the... Off the agenda. And if I don't, then I guess maybe I'll stream tomorrow or something. Shit, I don't know. Kind of weird day up and up. I'm up way too early and yeah, this is how the day's gonna go. I think I'm gonna find something else to do, <laughs> you know. But uh, well, have a good one. I'll see you on man. If you're uh, if you're gonna get some time off and stuff, just hit me up and we'll we'll play some Dark Souls again. I haven't picked it up since we played last time. I haven't picked it up since. So. We need to pick up there or 
come up with a new idea and start a new character. Whatever you want to do, it doesn't matter. Work tomorrow night? All right, probably so. Probably so. It depends on when I'm up. My schedule has been completely off. So, I'm going to get out of here. Take it easy, man. Have a good one. And I'll see you whenever.